good to see you again. Well, let's start. Here we go. One, two, three, Jesus loves me. One, two, Jesus loves you. Three, four, he loves you more than you ever been loved before. Five, six, seven, we're going to heaven. Eight, nine, he's a friend of mine. Nine, ten, it's time to end. But instead, let's learn the number zero to ten. Well, welcome back. Let's find out today's number. Are you ready? Here we go. Today's number is number nine. Let's take a look at the shape of the number. Ready? Here we go. Here we go. Oops. Stop. It's a circle and one more line. And at the slide line. Okay. Well, let's do this. Get your magic finger out. We're gonna do two lines. Ready? We're gonna start with ooh, circle and slight line. One more time. Ready? Circle and slight line. Did you do it? Good. Okay, well, let's look at that spelling of nine, the word nine. N, n. That's right. Naughty, naughty, N says N. Start with letter N. And what about next one? Nine, I. That's right, that is I. But I is usually we do itching. Itching, I says I. The sound of I is the one that we've been using, but today's sound is I. That sound of the name of the letter I, right? So just like ice cream. So we have two way of reading I. Today we're gonna use the one says I. That's easy. And nine, n, n. That's right, N again. So we'll put another N. Nine. Oh, we need one more. Well, Remember how we spell the number one? That's right. It finished with E, right? O-N-E. And that E was shh, silent E. Very quiet, no sound. So that's the same as nine. We're going to put the silent E. Just like a one. So N-I-N-E, nine. When I see number nine, this reminds me of We are going to learn what the number nine in French is. So I will count from zero up until nine and then you'll hear that word, okay? Zero, un, deux, trois, quatre, cinq, six, sept, huit, neuf. Did you hear that? Number nine in French is ne. Okay, now let's do our hot It's getting very long. Okay, go. Zero, un, deux,
Hello everyone. Today, oh, look at that. Our cake is getting bigger and bigger. Ooh, let's count and see how many layers we have on the cake. Okay, are you ready? We'll start at the bottom. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Today we are talking all about the number nine. Hmm, that's a big number. Mmm, I'm smelling something yummy right now. Oh, I'm looking over there. It's at the donut shop. I'm smelling some donuts. Ooh, I think I'm going to go over to the donut shop and check them out, okay? I'll be right back. Oh, boys and girls, I am so excited. <gasps> Look what I have here. Well, let's see how many donuts. I think we're at the donut shop and we have a whole bunch of donuts and I'm going to buy some donuts today so that we can maybe take them and go on a little picnic together. Does that sound like a good idea? Yeah, okay, let's see how many donuts we have in our donut shop, okay? Are you ready? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. <gasps> Boys and girls, we have nine donuts in our donut shop. Oh, that looks so yummy, I can hardly wait to eat those donuts. Oh, I need to go find some money here so I can get some money out and get some ready to buy some donuts. Oh, they look so delicious. Oh, 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 dear, one of our donuts is missing. Oh, how many do we have now? We have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I wonder who took those donuts. One, per somebody took a donut. Hmm, who took the donuts from the donut shop? Do you think it was Dinosaur? Dinosaur took the donut from the donut shop. Who, me? Yes, you, not me. Then who? I wonder who it could be. Oh no, we have another one missing. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. We only have seven left. Someone keeps taking our donuts. Oh no, do you think it's Giraffe? Do you think it was the giraffe? Who took the donut from the donut shop? Giraffe took the donut from the donut shop. Who, me? Yes, you, not me. Then who? I wonder who keeps taking them. Oh, oh no, we have another one missing. Now we only have one, two, three, four, five, six donuts in our donut shop. Someone keeps taking our donuts. I don't know who could be taking them all. Oh, let's see. Maybe it was fish. Oh, maybe it was the fish. Who took the donut from the donut shop? Fish took the donut from the donut shop. Who, me? Yes, you, not me. Then who? I wonder who keeps taking them. Oh, oh no, we only have one, two, three, four, five donuts left. Oh dearie me, I wonder who keeps taking all our donuts. This is crazy, this must be a real mystery. Oh, maybe it was raccoons, raccoons like donuts. Who took the donut from the donut shop? Raccoon took the donut from the donut shop. Who, me? Yes, you, not me. Then who? Oh, oh no, boys and girls, this is a real mystery. How many do we have left now? We only have one, two, three, four. You know what? I think I better buy my donuts quick because they keep disappearing. So I'm gonna take one, two, three, four donuts. Oh, I better get them quick before they disappear. But I wonder, hmm, where did all our donuts go? Do you know who took our donuts from our donut shop? <gasps> oh, Sammy, do you think it was Sammy? Oh, he doesn't look very good, does he? I think he might have a sore tummy. Do you have a sore tummy, Sammy? Yeah, did you eat too many donuts? Yeah. Oh dear, Sammy, that's not a good idea. You know what? Donuts are okay to eat, but you don't want to eat so many. Maybe next time when you're hungry, you should have some fruits and vegetables. Do you think that's a good idea, boys and girls? I think so too. So, but you know what? I don't think Sammy will be doing that again for a while because he's going to have a big tummy ache. But you know what? 
I have lots of donuts here. So we can share our donuts and have a wonderful little snack together. So Sammy, I hope you feel better soon. Yeah, you take care, okay? And remember, fruits and vegetable. Good idea. All right. Well, <laughs> that was a fun story. Are you feeling a bit better, Sammy? Yeah, a little bit better? Oh, that's good. Well, today, Sammy's gonna help me with our candle. So let's light our candle. Are you ready? Here we go. Big old nine. That's a big number. <gasps> there we go. Are you ready, Sammy? Yeah, you're all ready. So we're gonna have to count to nine, and then we're gonna blow, okay? Are you ready? Yeah, okay, here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Now take a big deep breath, everybody. <gasps> there, we did it. Good. Sammy says bye, and Mrs. Sue says bye. We'll see you next time, everybody. What you have? What you have on your head? Hmm. Show him. Oh. Ah. <laughs> That's right. It's a. I'm just gonna get this out. Up. Uh, oh. It's a baseball glove. That's right. I wonder what Froggy has in his mouth. Can you guess? Oh, let's ask him. Here you go. One, two, three. Open up, Froggy. Okay, Froggy, what do you have? Yeah. Oh? <laughs> of course, it's a, it's a baseball. Well, thank you, Froggy. Oh, that must have been so heavy to put this big glove on your head. Have you played baseball? Well, when you play baseball, you need one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine people to play. Right? And then you need a, a glove and a ball and a bat. Well, it's so fun to play sports like baseball. So let's give thank God that we can play sports. This is a sign for sports. You have two thumbs up and it go back and forth. Ready? Thank you, got that we can play sports. Thank you, got that we can play sports. Thank you, got that we can play sports. Right where we are. Here we go. Hallelujah, praise the Lord. Hallelujah, praise the Lord. Hallelujah, praise the Lord. Right where we are. Let's pray. Thank you, God, that we can play sports like baseball, basketball, hockey, soccer, tennis, and swimming, and maybe many more. Well, through playing sports, we can learn how to work as a team, sharing good times and challenging challenges. And playing sports also helps us build uh, healthy bodies and minds. And thank you, God, that, uh, that we have the peace that we can play and enjoy sports. In Jesus' name, amen. Amen. Okay. Well, it's time to say goodbye. Well, I'm glad you join us today because we have one more week to go in this number video. So make sure you will watch the video again next week. And language we learned last week was, that's right, Italian. Well, in, in the country Italy, people speak the language Italian. So they will say, Ciao amico mio for goodbye my friend. Ready? Here we go. Ciao amico mio ciao. Ciao amico mio ciao. 
Ciao amico mio, ciao amico mio, ciao amico mio, ciao. Well, thank you for joining us. Come on, Froggy. Let's say goodbye. Here we go. See you next week. Ciao.